Welcome back. As we saw in the case of sheet metal cutting operations, we need to calculate the force that will be required to perform the cutting operation so that we can uh, determine the tonnage of the press that will be used to perform that operation. So the formula to calculate the bending force is this shown on the slide. So here K is the bending factor and it depends upon the bending operation being performed. So it is 1.33 for V bending and 0.33 for edge bending. So that is multiplied by the tensile strength of the sheet metal. W is the part width in direction of the bend axis and T is the thickness of the blank and D is the die opening dimension. So you could easily see from here that the force required for bending is directly proportional to the tensile strength of the metal being bent. So uh, higher the tensile strength, more will be the force required. It also depends upon the width of the blank being bent. So greater is the width, greater is the force required. And similarly, the thicker the sheet is, the more is the force required. And smaller is the die opening dimension, more is the force required because you have to concentrate the force on a smaller region. So in that case, force required will be greater. So let's uh, see first uh, different uh, variables that are in this equation. So width and thickness are very obvious. So we have a starting blank that has a certain uh, length and width, so W is that width of the part, T is the thickness of the, uh, of the blank, so that is T, tensile strength uh, can be found from the handbooks, and then is the D, so D is the size of the die opening, so this is the D in the case of V bending, and in the case of edge bending, and this is the D that is equal to uh, the, the gap between, uh, between the punch and the die and sum of the radii. So you could see this is that dimension. Let's solve a simple example. A sheet metal blank is to be bent as shown in the figure. So this is the final part that we have to make. The metal has a yield strength of 275 megapascals and tensile strength of 450 megapascals. Determine the bending force if a V die is used with die opening of 25 mm. So we will I use formula, this one. We know the width. Uh, we know the thickness as well. The tensile strength is given and the die opening size is 25 mm. So we are discussing V bending. So this size is 25 mm. So we will put values in the formula and we will get a force of uh, 10,909 Newtons. So we need a press that can apply this force or greater than this to bend this part. And I have a question for you. That can you find the starting blank size as we have already discussed as well as the position of layout line and band lines for this part. So take it as an exercise to find these uh, values of the starting blank size as well as the position of the layout line. There will be one layout line because there is one band that we have to make and two corresponding band lines. So solve it and discuss uh, after solving. Thank you.